supposed to gloves here and this is another video in the sound and synth basics today we're talking about wavetable synthesis what is wavetable synthesis well massive is a wavetable synthesizer however serum is better but i don't have serum and i can think of a way to turn even harmer into a wavetable synthesizer using its additive capabilities it's sort of a, a plot twist so if i come over here to massive we have all these things these are all wave tables. And the way it works is, oh, okay, there we go. The way it works is you pick a wave table and what they do is they put a bunch of waveforms in there and then they morph through these waveforms. They call it wavetable synthesis. Now, I was taught in school that wavetable synthesis is actually when you just use a waveform as the basis for your oscillator, which is essentially what they're doing. And they kind of expanded on the concept and said, now you can morph through the different waveforms you can use as a basis for your oscillator. Now it's a thing. Harmer has an imagery synthesizer that it additively generates, which is a special feature unique to Harmer. Um, so I could zoom in on like uh, one thing and change it up. And I could essentially make it into a wavetable. I could pick a waveform and make that my waveform. I could even do it with the timbre. And this is all stuff that's Harmer specific though. So go check out Harmer if you want to know about that. Massive has these and you can morph through them. Serum allows you to generate and create your own stuff. Your own wavetables that you can morph through. Similar to Massive. And so that's kind of become what the new age synthesize, synthesis. Not necessarily... On a technical academic level, it's still whatever the waveform is that makes your sound. But nowadays, it's really the ability to morph through a series of waveforms to create something. But wavetable synthesis at its core is just, you know, you have a, a waveform and you're making that your period or your cycle for a bigger waveform. Uh, which can do a number of interesting things. So like, for example, here's grown, what is this, grown for? And it's just a bunch of things I'm scrolling through using the wavetable position. I have a series for Massive as well, if you're interested. Uh, subscribe and have a blessed day.